What's up, girly? Welcome back to my channel. If you watched my last vlog, it's the same day as... Well, no, because yesterday I ended the vlog and today I posted it, so that's where we're at now. Today is a Friday, and I'm actually about to head to Meijer because I'm starting my house makeover probably tomorrow, but I need to go tonight and buy, like, some totes because I want to organize things, so I'm going to organize it into totes on the floor, and it's going to be, like, glam room, toy room. I might be able to mix those two, so, like, maybe a couple of totes. And, well, really, like, the kitchen, living room stuff, I can just walk to it, but... Hi, if you're new here, my name is Michael, and my favorite color is pink, and I love to shop. And right now, I'm about to just give my trailer, like, a little makeover. I own a three-bedroom trailer. I've given a makeover before, but I've bought in so much stuff over, the, like, the last year on TikTok, and I've, like, just... My mind went blank when I was buying everything, and now it's too cluttered, and I need to clear it all out so I can clear my mind out. If that makes any sense to you, but I kind of want to show you my outfit because it's actually really cute, and it's all the new stuff that I got from my last vlog. So this top is new. This top was from Victoria's Secret, if you don't remember. And then these pants are from Hollister. They're like the wide leg, but I think they're such like a cute fit. Like I feel so cute in this. And actually it's really flattering like in the back because it like kind of hugs right here. Now is this weird? Mine has like a dark patch right here, but it's not like a tag. I feel like that's, I'm like, was this pair not made right? You know what I mean? It's got like a dark thing, but not like, is, is that how Hollister pants are? But Anyways, they're really cute, just like flattering and fitting, and I'm going to wear my Adidas shoes. I'm going to go in Meijer. I don't know. We'll see how busy it is in Meijer. That will depend on if I vlog in there or not, if I just do a little haul after whenever I get home. But I am buying a lot of like food and drinks and stuff too. Oh, I cleaned out my fridge. I want to show you that. I just haven't had any good snacks lately, so I was like, I have to stop and um, get some snacks, but my fridge was so full of just stuff that like I couldn't eat or didn't want to eat or was a lot of it was expired. So I just cleaned it out and uh, flipped the camera around. This is the freezer. I wanted to get rid of that ice because I don't really need it. But my trash can outside is full and trash day is not until Tuesday. But I got rid of all those sodas, which they were expired. I was actually going to drink one the other night and they were expired. Everything else, like, I can actually drink and use. But I need to go get a lot more now. I also cleaned out, like, this little area right here. This is just, like, my little pantry. So I had, like, a bunch of snack cakes in here. But they were from, like, early December, so, like, they didn't even have the original packaging on it anymore because I put it in those jars, so I didn't know if they were expired or not, so they kind of, like, freaked me out. So I just went ahead and got rid of a lot of stuff that was expired, and I just wasn't going to eat no more. I need to go get some more stuff. Look at this cat right here. I'm not going to get too much. I just want to get, like, some good snacks that I know I will eat all of. It's a lot different buying for myself now that I live alone because I need to eat all the food that I have here. Not that I really ate much at work, but I used to buy, like, fast food every day while I was at work. And now I don't want to rely on fast food every single day. I'm also about to switch out my purse. So this is the purse I'm going to switch out to, if you remember this, from Christmas. It's the Michael Kors purse. But I feel like with this outfit, this purse just looks a little bit better. Let's look in the mirror see if I'm right like don't you think this just looks a little bit a little bit cute I think it looks cute I'm about to take a picture for like my story and then I will catch up with you when I'm in the car or Meyer or something like that do you want to see a little behind the scenes of the intro I'm about to film I was about to do it and then I was like let me prop up my vlogging camera and just let them see I, I kind of just want to see what it looks like um make sure my camera is not foggy Let's really check out my fridge. I just cleaned it out and I have like nothing in it. So now I need to go to Meijer and get some snacks for this weekend. Let's really check out my fridge. I just cleaned it out and I have like nothing in it. So now I need to go to Meijer and get some snacks for this weekend. Let's really check out my fridge. I just cleaned it out and I have like nothing in it. So now I need to go to Meijer and get some snacks for this weekend. I wonder if that was cute. I hope that was cute. We're just gonna go with it. I feel cute, but like... Um. Cool watching me take pictures. 
I am at Meyer. I just got my totes. I just got three of them. So I'm going to go do my grocery shopping. There is kind of a lot of people in here, but I want to go do my grocery shopping TikTok and I'll meet you at the house. Also, wait, look at these. Look at these. Valentine's Day pink cocoa bombs. I hope that they're yummy. So when I left the, so, so when I left the grocery store just now, I was thinking, I was like, maybe I should get Burger King. And then I was like, no, I just bought all that food. I'll go home and I'll cook something. Even though I'm really hungry, I just wanted to eat something on the way home. But then I was like, oh, I have some Cheetos. And I bought like one of those pokey lemonades, you know? So I was like, oh, I'll eat and drink those in the car on the way home. They're all the way in the back. <laughs> Why'd I do that? I can't reach it. I mean, I'm at a red light, but... Oh my gosh, what do you want me to crawl back there? I'm scared. It's like the longer you hesitate. It's not worth it. My house is not that far. My house is not that far away. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's just like the drink I really wanted. I do have water, but this water is not that same as that strawberry lemonade. Alright, screw it. Oh my gosh, the light would turn green. The light would. Don't second guess yourself in 2024. Don't do it. Don't be a chicken. Don't second guess yourself. Scott Book. <laughs> I just got back home and I filmed a grocery restock video. Let me go ahead and just show you it real quick. But I also got my toast right there. Um, so I just got like a bunch of snacks that I'll actually eat like frozen stuff. Like I got toaster strudels. I got some um, frozen chicken wings like these kind. And then I got these like um, these frozen strawberries. <laughs> I'm like really hungry. I can't even think straight. I might make those, the chicken rings, because I've never had the original. And the spicy are really good, but they're really, really spicy. But in the fridge, let me just flip the camera around. I got my Yoohoo's. I don't know what to do with those old display things yet. I got a couple of my teas right there. I'm about to drink one in a second. And I got a few more of my drinks. That's what I was missing. I just needed some drinks and some better snacks around the house. I also have over here, like I got some hot fries. I got some cereal. I got some uh, fudge mix. Remember last vlog, I really wanted some brownies. And then they also had baked hot Cheetos. So this is what I was just eating a second ago. I love baked hot Cheetos and they're kind of hard to find, especially at Meijer. Mm. I just bit the side of my cheek. Why have I been doing that so much lately? I keep biting this side of my cheek. I had also gotten some boring stuff like these razors and then I got some hairspray. I like the rave hairspray if you know me, you know. But this isn't bad. It like the rave hairspray is almost more wet like so you can kind of control it more. And then I use that to really like set it and lock it because once you set it with that, it's really hard to move around. So I'm going to, I don't know what, I'm going to edit and post these videos, eat a couple baked Cheetos while I do that and then make something to eat and I don't know when I'll check in with you but I'll check in when I check in. Good morning girly. It is the next day. It is Saturday. I know I look a little bit scary. I'm trying to figure out how I can look cute before I shower in the morning and this definitely ain't it but I was on the toilet. Just woke up on the toilet and I heard a package get dropped off so let's go get it. Let's go open it. This is like my new favorite thing at the moment is opening up the packages. What was that sound? My, my Alexa. Opening up the packages as soon as I get them instead of taking them in and dragging them to the clean room and opening them up, opening them up days later. I mean, I used to have to do that because I'd get home from work and have packages and not feel like opening them yet. But now that I get to just wake up at a decent time and go get the packages, it's a little fun. So we're gonna go get that and I'll set you right here. I'll go get the package. I'll be back and I'll show it to you. Okay, so I also have an Instacart order about to come. It's just like pet supplies and cat supplies, like cat food, pet food, fish tank filter cleaner stuff so I can clean it out. I swear I need to clean out this fish tank like every week is what it seems like. I already need to add some new water and I kind of want to like scrub the walls and stuff real good. <clears throat> oh gosh. Cats. Alright. I know that this ain't like the cutest angle or lighting or nothing like at all. Let's see what's is. I think it's everything I'm expecting. Here's my tripod. Ooh, this thing is heavy and bulky. Oh, hang on. I didn't realize I was being blocked. Look at this. This is for my vlogging camera. I hope this thing is easy to set up. I hope it's not too heavy. I really just need this for around the house, though. It's not like I'm taking it anywhere. Unless I wanted to travel, I'd probably want to take it, but this thing is heavy and big. I wonder if there's a smaller 
a smaller, more slim tripod you could get like this. I didn't think it looked that big online. We'll see what it looks like when I open it, but it looks really bulky and heavy. This is my satin set. I'm so excited for this. I hope that the neck is a good fit on the shirt. Cause I got like a different set than normal and ugh, I actually don't like this. <laughs> I don't like this. This looks like a, stop cat. This looks like a, a nurse shirt. <laughs> oh my gosh, this looks so much cuter in the stores. I just thought it was kind of like a t-shirt instead of like those usual satin sets. Um, I don't know if I like this. We'll try it on, like we'll wear it tonight. Ew, why does it smell like fish? I hate when satin stuff, or like you order stuff online that smells like that. These shorts, however, look really cute and fitting. Yeah, these look like these, these would fit me nice because they're like kind of big. So, I hope that this top kind of goes with the shorts. It looked a lot cuter online, not gonna lie. I'm gonna go throw this in the laundry pile. It stinks. And I'll try to wear it later. But here's the rocks I have gotten. They're just like these pink crystal rocks. I was thinking of putting them in this vase over here. I thought that might be cute. Or I'll just put them somewhere. I haven't decided yet. I had a gift card and I just needed to spend the last $10. So I was like, ooh, let me look up something random. Let's dump them in this vase just to see what they look like. I hope it's not like ugly. If it's ugly, then we'll take them out the vase, but. looks very random yeah I don't think that's like I think it's a cute concept but I don't know I'm just gonna keep them right there for now but they probably won't stay in that thing if you have a better idea for those rocks please let me know I just got my Instacart order I'm gonna show you everything I got and then I'm gonna clean out the fish tank real, sh real quick before I shower and everything so that's the tripod that I had got off of Amazon I got this um, this is the cat litter I always get Here's the cat food I usually get. This is the smaller thing, and this is the smaller thing of uh, dry food I usually get. I usually get like the big, big packs, but I think this is all that they had online. I also got this for the fish tank, and then I also got some of this, so I'm gonna go ahead and like give it a quick clean and fill up, and then I'm gonna shower, and then I'm going to, I don't know what I'll do after that. We'll just start getting into stuff. What's up, girly? I have done a lot without consulting you, my bad, but I just want to show you what I've done with my bedroom. So I moved my bed. When you're first just looking at it like this, it looks a little crazy, like a little crowded, you know? But when you actually go into the room, it feels a lot bigger. So you walk in and I got all this like open room over here that I used to not have. And the door actually still shuts. It's not like blocking the door at all. And so I'm not done, but I done went ahead and like cleared out these drawers and stuff and I probably need to clean that box fan. I might like put something new right here. This is, well actually those are some clothes, but underneath it is decorations that I want to put up on the walls, but I need to get my desk in here first so this isn't staying. I want to put like a little desk right there and then have a little chair right here and then I'll probably move that nightstand like over here or something. Well. I don't know what I'll do with that nice stand. I'm going to get a desk in here. That's the whole purpose. I need to wash these sheet and blankets because usually my cat would lay on this side and I would sleep on this side. But since I turned it, now I need to wash all her hair off of this side. But I hung up my mood board or my vision board right there. So I think that's pretty cute. Like most of the stuff up on the walls might not stay how it is. This is just how I put it for now. I got like way too many stuffed animals. I also got a lot of stuff under the bed. Like I don't need those boxes. I need to throw them away. I just kind of got to wait till trash day. I got this just laying on the bed because I'm waiting to clean it out. But see it's not like too crowded over here. It's just like kind of when you first walk in that's what you see. So that's kind of like the impression you get. But it's my house. It's only got to be perfect for me. Over here I like it except this is like the animal food, the cat food. I'm going to put like another one of those right here. So maybe it's like those side by side. If I don't like it there, then I'll put it here and I'll move that back over there. And I'll put this in the closet or something. But I used to never have this closet shut. And it's almost like echoey in here now because of how just like I opened it up. But I don't know. I kind of really liked how my bed was before. I just didn't think a desk was going to fit in there like that. And I wanted something new and different. So we're just going to try this for a little bit. If I don't like it, then I'll switch my bed back. But either way, we're simplifying a lot. So that's a, just straight trash. This is a little donate bag. Those are mainly blankets filling it up. I feel sad because Tamari loves to like lay on this thing. But I just listed this on Facebook for free. So someone's probably going to come get it. It's a little bit like splotchy, but 
it's a nice nightstand. Um, I got this stuff full of just like things that need to go to the glam room. So I can take it back to the glam room and like simplify back there. This is kind of like homey stuff. And this is like toy room stuff. I'm also going to like come out in here and start like decluttering too. Like all these little corners. But it's honestly a lot more than I expected. And it's a little sadder than I expected. Like trying to get rid of all this stuff and simplifying. I thought it would be easy. But I'm really attached to a lot of the stuff that I have. So we'll um... I'm sure even a lot of the stuff in those toasts that I decided to save, I'll probably end up donating. So we'll just see how that goes. But for now, this is a little update. I had to stop, but I need to wash these sheet blankets. So that's what I'm going to do. And then I'll get to post my TikTok after I wash the sheet and blankets and make the bed. This little Hello Kitty thing is so cute. I'm waiting for it to actually go. I'll show you it later when it's actually going. Like, it feels like we're a little bit somewhere, but this is not the complete final look. I need to clean out under the bed, actually make the bed, I'll make it look nicer, and fix up the stuff on the walls. Like, that's just not going to stay there, and I don't know. But I do like how it looks, and I was, like, propping up my camera right there, and I love how it looks, like, kind of like a little Wake Up With Me vlog. Like, if you were to turn it up and down like this, like, this is how you record on an iPhone. It's kind of like this, so it's like... Good morning, girly. I woke up, hopped out of bed. Like, I, I like the angle, you know? I like it. I like the angle. So, I'm not used to having my closet door shut or the bathroom door shut. I mean, sometimes I do shut it, but sometimes I leave it open. I do need to clean out in here a little bit. That's, like, all my important stuff. I think my mom's mom had that piggy. I don't remember if that's true or not. And then I got some extra clothes. And that's more of my important stuff. But I need to organize all that. So, like, I will organize the closets and stuff, like... Just as we're going along, I really need to organize like every drawer and closet and everything in this house. But I need to chill for a little bit. I've been working on this for like two hours now. And I'm pretty proud of where we're at. I mean, I'm, I'm kind of happy with it. I'm not fully happy with it. But I feel like it's not done. So I can't really judge it yet. There's some parts of it I really like. Some parts of it I really don't. But I also don't do well with change. That's just like one thing about me. I mean, you, you've seen me break down already on this channel. So you know I don't do well with change. I'm just like really sensitive and right now in my life I feel extra sensitive but we're just gonna get past it and we're gonna get we're gonna get this place looking real cute I just need to, I need to take a break for the night and like gather my thoughts for a second look what I just got set up this is my camera tripod it is freaking huge compared to my iPhone one which is like perfect for traveling but um, this will be nice. I'll be able to um, scroll my camera into this right here. Let's go ahead and do that a little bit. Um, I think my case is getting in the way of it actually. My pink case. It's kind of like the rubber's like bending it. Alright, it's not fully secure in there, but it's somewhat. So now I can take this. Ugh. Ugh. Ugh, see all the trash in the background and I'll be able to just set it up and do stuff like this oh this is actually really nice can you imagine oh my gosh let's go to the kitchen let's go to the kitchen and let's see what it's like if I'm trying to make a meal and I want you to be there with me because that was the biggest thing that I wanted to like get past so like I could have come over here and I mean this is kind of good do like this I mean, I can angle the camera a bit better, too. But at least in this sense, we'll maybe turn on a light. Yeah, you can see me, like, cooking a meal. So if I was like, all right, girlie, I'm actually in the middle of a TikTok and making dinner, I could do it for you, too. We could talk. I usually just, like, listen to music, which I probably still do a lot. But I love this little tripod. It's giving me something tall to, like, set my camera on. Oh, my gosh. We're going to get all the angles now. All the angles. Ooh, it's big try not to hit everything it is really really big I saw one of my cats playing under it I was like oh you like that okay, let's take off this camera this way am I tightening it or loose it all right we got it off we got it off it's just like see this little screw thingy in my camera I mean I'm sure most cameras do have a little thing so it can attach to it so I feel really fancy with this thing and I'm really happy that I got this. No regrets, just wish it could somehow be a little bit more skinny and like <laughs> better for travel. 
I mean, it did come in this big old case, but still, I mean, I got my little one, but I really love my stand-up one. Happy with that. Also, I just threw my sheet blanket in the washer and dryer. Oh my gosh, look at how cute this is. I'm sipping, I'm <laughs> sipping on a Yoohoo, but look what I just noticed. Ugh, kind of get flipped around. Look at it. The Hello Kitty lava lamp is doing its thing. Ooh. Oh my gosh, this is really good quality. Wow. I should start taking more pictures on this camera. I don't know why I don't take enough pictures, but I just walked in here to go use the bathroom real quick and I saw it and I was like, ooh, I have to show them. But I'm waiting for my sheet and blanket to dry so I can put it on the bed. It's starting to grow on me. I'm starting to like it. At first I was a bit taken back. You know I don't like change, but I'm already starting to see the vision and this ain't the final look. I'm going to get one more of those and decide what to do with it. Actually, I'll probably get two more of those because I need one for the glam room too. And decide what to do about this white thing and I'll probably take that poster down or move it and I will I got all those decorations to put up still and like those two things probably won't stay there what's up really here's a bedroom update I also did a tiny bit in the living room but first of all I cleaned that satin set and yeah I was right it's giving ugly I should just got like a regular set like you know how the pajama sets are usually like cut right there I just thought online it looked like a vibe but it's kind of weird and it's like long in the back the shorts aren't so bad like I kind of like Kind of like this part of the shorts, I guess, but yeah, this set's uh, um, a 3 out of 10 for me because I might still wear it just around the house. <laughs> but real quick, before I show you what I did in the living room, let me show you the bedroom. I'm kind of starting to like it now, now that the bed's all made. So you walk in, like I said, it looks like a lot when you walk in, but I have all this open room that like I didn't really have before. So I got the bed made. Let's get all the way in here. Look at Tamari. Got some extra decorations to put up. We already talked about that. I put a few things up here just because I thought they were cute, but they probably won't stay. Who knows? Just the bed and all its cuteness. Not much going on there. And then there's like the outside of my house. I'm going to get something new for there. That's just my purse and tripod. The lava lamp is a lava lamp in. And I just thought that this was funny. That's the first vlogging camera I had bought. That one right there was like $150 off of Amazon and it sucks. So don't buy that one. Buy the one that I have right now, which is a lot more expensive, but it works. This literally looks like a hospital shirt, but I just organized two things in the living room. So I organized right here inside my coffee table it was so messy. I literally had to like vacuum it out, but I got it real neat and organized looking. I also organized over here. It was just like getting super messy. So even like inside the drawers, I just got it looking a lot better than it did before. I need to print out a picture for that frame. Once I get that everything all together I might buy some like picture frames to hang around since I have my printer so I can print out a bunch of cute pictures but I'll probably chill for the rest of the night and then I'll get back at you tomorrow with what we're gonna do I'm going to uh, do more probably in this bedroom before I venture out into the living room but I'm already excited to venture out into the living room and start like simplifying it in here also these totes are full so I'm like do I need to get more totes? Should I start going through that stuff or just like throw stuff in the rooms they belong in? Like toy room, glam room, just throw stuff in there? I don't know. This shirt is not it. I'm going to look for some cute different satin sets on Amazon. I like looking in stores so much better than looking on Amazon. But I'm going to go chill for the night and I'll see you tomorrow. So girlies, it's the next day. I woke up a little bit unmotivated today. So it's already like 5 p.m. and I haven't done much recording. I think it's just because it's Sunday, so I'm like, I don't know, just a little bit out of it. But I did decide to get into it anyway, so I'll show you everything that I've done. I showed you that last night, and I showed you my little side table last night, like, all cleaned off. But I just went a little bit deeper and got into it for a TikTok video, watching the 100. Just, like, taking away some stuff from here. So you can see there's, like, less Funko Pops down there. I took down everything that was over here and I kind of made it like an extra candle shelf like have all these extra candles and then moved those stuffed animals right there. Bed's looking cute. I woke up, mo made my bed this morning just to like help motivate me but I don't know what it is. I think I'm just like ugh Sunday. Um, I took the sticker off this finally. Everyone on TikTok was like there's a sticker on that and I was like for real? And it looks so much better but Right now I have the little battery charging because it doesn't reach the cord. So I'll show you what it looks like on in just a second. But this corner I'm really proud of. So like the lighting doesn't do it any type of justice. But um, I have a lot right here like this big thing pretty much because when I contact papered this 
like it's not perfect and over here was the hardest part for me it was also like the last like I started over there and worked my way like this and it was really bubbly over here so I just covered it with a bunch of stuff but I think that it looks kind of cute and aesthetic let's see if I turn on this big light it looks a little bit better yeah, but my shadow's in, them, in the way. So I kind of simplified it over here, and I added those little flowers right there, but I don't have enough. But you can kind of see what I was going for. Remember those crystals? I thought this was genius. I have them, like, lying down there. I don't know what to put right there. I don't know if I'll put anything, but just the crystals right there I think look so cute. So I, like, simplified everything, kind of took, like, all the toys out. Here's the tote. So that's, like, glam room stuff. This is just kind of, like, everywhere. And then this is toy room stuff. Like, I have so many Funko Pops and stuff in there. But, um, I'll take them back and I'll decide what I'm keeping, what I might, like, donate. I also simplified over here, so there's, like, not much over here. I did keep King Triton because he kind of, like, controls the water, you know. There's also a little aerial right there. And then not much over here. So you come to my couch. My couch has, like, all these little stains on it. It's so annoying. Like, ugh. But anyways, then you come over here and I changed up this a little bit. I did decide to keep some of the Naruto stuff over here just because it's cute and I like it. But I need to print off some pictures for these frames. Like I have that one and I have these two over here. They look like 4 by 6s so I need to do that. But I knew you guys were going to like the rocks right there because that's just like really cute little detail. And you know I didn't know what to do with those. Hi fishies. So let's come over here. So then I decided I wanted to work over here a little bit because that was super cluttered. And it's still not like ideal. Like I'll probably throw that pink thing out. But I just kind of like lightly touch this area. And then I also got like all the candles that was in this corner. So this corner looks a lot better. Like I like the way that looks. Although I want to get all that stuff down. But I need to get into the cabinets first. I also want to get another one of these for the other side. Because I think it's kind of cute like that. Whew, I'm running out of breath, but anyways, you'll come over here, and I didn't really do much over here. I did take away a couple things over here. It's looking a little awkward, so I need to change up on top of this a little bit. This is what I was using to um, charge my light, to like turn on my light over there. But then I rearranged the magnets on the fridge just a little bit. Like I tried to keep all the cutest ones up front, and some of them are stickers, so like can't really be moved. And then I put some on the side, and I put some on this side, not much, and I cleaned out up there, so I think that looks better. And I cleaned out, like, right there, just that little thing. Slowly but surely coming together, and I don't know. Oh, I ordered a desk from Target. I'm probably going to go shopping, like, I need to leave the house tomorrow or something, because I didn't really leave today. But I'll show you what I got from Target real fast. So it's this computer desk. Let's let's get it to load. And it's 31 and a half inches. So I measured. I can't have anything more than that's another picture of it. I can't have anything more than 40 inches right here. Right there by my bed. So I thought that might look kind of cute right there. But if I go shopping tomorrow and I find something cuter that's under 40 inches, then maybe I'll just like do a little refund. But I don't know. That was the best deal I could find. So I think it's pretty cute. And I think it should be perfect. It's just like enough area for me to sit there and like have my laptop and have a little kind of nightstandish. Here's what this sign is looking like. Pretty cool, right? But obviously I'm going to turn it on the pink. The pink. There we go. And I think it's cool. It's like a mirror. I wanted to put it somewhere else, like, right there. Like, I kind of want to get something new for right here. I really love this picture. But it's almost, like, yellowish in a way, if you know what I mean. I don't know. Let me know. If you really love it, then I'm, I'm probably not ready to get rid of it. I kind of love it, too. But I'm just, like, all for switching up and getting new stuff right now. I just wanted to show you that. I'm really mad at myself because I just ruined my makeup. But I just made a really sad video, kind of like TikTok video using the audio from that um, YouTube video where I, I quit my job. So I used the video, the audio from when I cried. And then I used the clips that I recorded on that day. And then I combined it that with a sad song. And so phew, here I am like reliving it all. And I mean, I'm still adjusting. It's still not easy. That's why I feel like I'm just cleaning up my house because I need to like feel new, start something new clear mind like people on TikTok are like good for you like the video I posted today did good like clearing out my house and stuff but it's just like they don't understand that I have so much more going on in my mind <laughs> some people were like I hope you're not just doing it because of rude commenters I'm like there's so much more going on that like 
I don't know. I just want everything to feel new. Like even after I clean this out, clean up my car, make my car feel like a little bit brand new. And then I'll feel like I can really start getting into shopping and traveling and like driving far for shopping or like checking into a hotel for the night, just doing something fun. <gasps> I got the hiccups. I just wanted to come on here and talk for a second cause I did ruin my makeup for the night. So you are gonna notice that. It looks weirdly streaky. You see that? Like you can see exactly where the tears went. I just thought that was a little funny, I guess, but it is funny. Like the video might be so dramatically sad and I don't even know if it's a good idea to post it, but I have it literally ready now, captioned and everything. So that's not how I planned on doing it. But while I was just sitting here like chilling, I thought about it and well I don't even know how I thought about it like I think I saw like a sad edit or something I was like what if I did that with like my audio and it came out like way more sad than I expected <laughs> but it doesn't really explain it I mean it does kind of explain enough to TikTok it does kind of explain and I don't know it's the song it's like a dramatic version of the song like only love can hurt like this <laughs> So you know it has me crying, but oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm really happy with the way my house is coming out though. I'll show you more of it um, tomorrow. Like, I don't know, I might check in later or something, but I'll show you more of the house tomorrow, figure out what we're gonna do. I need to clean out the kitchen some more. I'm just kind of waiting because I know like the stuff under the bed, like the boxes, my trash can is full and trash day is until Tuesday, so I can't throw away a whole lot right now. So I'm trying not to like, do a lot of stuff that requires throwing away like big boxes so i'm going to go through the cabinets tomorrow because i got a lot of stuff that i just don't want anymore and i'll put those in the back for donating that's what we'll do and then we'll get to donate them this week and i got a couple days to work on the house and go out and do stuff like that but then what is it thursday i have my teeth appointment my dentist i get got to get a cleaning Friday, I have my nail appointment, you gotta get my nails done, and then Saturday is that photo shoot, which I'm like, getting less nervous for, like more excited, I just hope that when the day comes, I'm not super nervous, I hope I'm still like, just excited for it, but um, yeah, it's like, I'm booked and busy for those three days, look at me, but I, I hope 2024 kind of gets like that, I want to get my ducks in a row now, so that I can be booked and busy, taking trips, like, oh my gosh, could you imagine like, just me being ready by summertime, like that's what I want. I want to have like the best summer, the best year ever. Just like the start of a real career. Do you know what I mean? Good morning, girly. I woke up and I showered and I'm probably going to get ready to go shopping here in just a minute. I'm not sure where. I just need to get out of the house. It's been like a couple days since I left the house. But I just got two packages get dropped off at pretty much like the same time. So let's open them, see what they are. So this first one right here is my underwear from American Eagle. So I'll show you that because there's probably some boys just like me who watch me. So they might want to see some cute underwear like that. And I have no clue what this box is. I don't even recognize like the address. So let's get a nice look and open it. It's over here, cuter than over there was. Let's just open them up over here in the kitchen. I want to scoot some of this like centerpiece stuff from my island off to the side like my candles and my little tray and let's see what's in this big box first since I have literally no clue I also told TikTok this morning I posted my little video so basically everyone knows that I quit my job now which honestly felt like way off my shoulder what is this it's big whatever it is big and pink Oh my gosh, it's a huge package from Essence. Like, huge. Look how cute this thing is. <sighs> Essence is like my favorite mascara. I've been using the It Cosmetics Superhero Mascara, so I feel like a little cheater. But this tank top's not like tucked in or nothing, so it's real loose fitting, but usually I have it like really tight. This is so cute. Little card. Lash Princess Mascara Primer. So, oh, a brown mascara. People told me I should try a brown mascara. Let's see what's in here. That's so cute. Look at this. It's just their new. Um, well, I don't know. Is this new? 
It's a lash primer and it's a black brown mascara it says. I have to see what that looks like. Lift to meet the rest. Oh, there's more. So this is the rest of them. Look at it. Oh my gosh. I want to see this like brown one. So the purple one right here is like my all time favorite. And then the green one's probably my second. I I liked the pink one at one point too. I feel like like the pink one wasn't bad. So like I would label it green. Oh no, no, no. Purple, green, pink. And I don't think the blue was that great. I don't remember. It's the waterproof one. I feel like waterproof ones sometimes aren't that great. And then for each one, I, I don't think I've ever tried. I've only tried those four. Oh my gosh, it's a brown mascara. I'm like really excited to try this. It probably looks darker on camera than it is in real life, but it's even like a brown tube with pink packaging. Like imagine if I end up loving this. I can't wait. Let's put it back so I can take a picture of it all. And then I'm gonna show you my underwear real quick. Literally obsessed. You think any of that made a cute thumbnail? Well, I don't know. We'll leave it in and we'll see. But thank you so much, Essence. I don't know if they watch my YouTube, but I know they're like, they watch me on TikTok. I like hardly ever order underwear. Like last time I did was like well over a year ago. I don't know why. It's just one of those things that like I never bring myself to order, but they didn't have as many cute pairs as they had previously. This was the cutest pair I had found, this pink pair right here with like just the eagles on it. And I get the boxer brief, the three inch. So that's like the shortest that they go is three inches. So on me, it probably stops at about here, the underwear line. So that's just like a really comfortable fit for me. And then I had gotten just this like light gray pair. They were like buy one, get one 50% off. And then, okay, yeah, I was about to say, I thought this had a black strap. It has like a tissue paper on it. So it was like just, it was like, I'm um, making me think that the top is gray, you know what I mean? But no, it's just an all black pair, so really like that. And then I got this three pack, so it's an all white pair, all gray pair, all black pair. So just neutral colors. They didn't have any cute. They used to have so many cute like pink pairs and like other other colorful other colorful pairs, but they didn't have much. So this was the only like pink pair I got. I really like the black, and I also really like the white. And the grays are just like whatever. But that's the kind of. Um, boxers I get. It's the three inch inseam three pack. The just classic trunk boxer breeze. So like the tight kind, you know. And I get them in a size small. Really a humbling moment. Tell me why I just held these up and I was like, oh these look big. Like they be too big for me. And then I held it up to my waist. I was like, oh no. Humbled. <laughs> They fit. Y'all, I was just getting ready to leave when another package got dropped off. Do you think it's my camera? I don't know, I don't think so, because it says Michael Duval XO on it. It would just say my name. It would just say Michael Duval if it was my camera, but it's heavy. I really thought it was my camera up until just that second. But, um, unless it still is. Cat, stop. No, it's not. What is this? Someone sent me a bunch of like Apple Watch bands. I don't know what this is from a company, Tismo. High-end product, stainless steel. They just look like Apple Watch bands. Let me show you. This is it, have I even showed it? I don't know what this is, really. A guide for adjusting band. I mean, this is kind of cute. Like I might actually wear that. There's like a gold one too, another silver one with like a slightly different pattern. This one is silver and gold, and this one's gold. So thanks Tismo, I, I didn't know I was getting this really like at all. But still exciting, not my camera though. <clears throat> I did just get ready, I'm wearing this bloom sweatshirt again because it's really cute and comfy. I just pulled it out the dryer. I'm gonna go to a Walmart. I wanna go to a nice one. Not one close to my house, but a nicer, nicer one. I just got to Walmart. Look how cute this little purse is. I got it a while back from The Gate, if you know what that is. They like sent me stuff whenever I first started on TikTok, but I don't so much go for stuff like that anymore. 
but I was like, hey, why not use this cute bag? I hate when you're putting on lip gloss and you feel like a crunchy or something in it. I also want to get a piece of gum, so I got some fresh breath. And then I'm just here to pick up a few essentials. I also want to get like um, two of those six cube shelves. One for my glam room, one for my bedroom. I'm at Steak and Shake, I'm getting some Steak and Shake. You guys know I love me some Steak and Shake. I, I also come here because it's close by, but I think I'm gonna get a cheeseburger today instead of the chicken tenders. Well, the chicken fingers do sound good. At first I was wanting a cheeseburger and now I'm seeing the chicken tenders and I'm like, ooh. Oh gosh, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna do a cheeseburger. I'm gonna get a double steak burger, actually. Can I get a number one with only cheese and pickles on it? What's it, A sweet tea. Is that it? Yes. Uh, okay, thanks. Yeah. This is like one of the only places that don't ask you what size drink you need, but that's okay because I don't have to make a choice. <laughs> I love not having to make a choice. I need to spit out my gum. I'm gonna spit it into this water bottle. Okay, so um, I didn't even tell you. So I left Walmart. I got one of the shells I needed. I wanted to get two of them. I even checked the app before I went. I said it was in stock, but it didn't say how many was in stock. Just one. So I gotta go to another Walmart if I wanna get another one of those six cube shells. I'll show you when I get to the house. But I also got a Hello Kitty pajama set. So like a new pajama set, but it's Hello Kitty. And then I got stuff to make um, cupcakes, so I'm gonna make like pink cupcakes, like pink frosting, pink wraps, these really cute sprinkles, I'm excited to show you that, but I thought that would just be a fun little video. And then at TJ Maxx, I just got a pink, they're all wrapped, I don't want to unwrap it because everything's like glass, I got a pink like measuring cup, it's not really a measuring cup, it's like a measuring jug, so it doesn't say how many cups, but it says like milliliters and stuff, that's a little bit weird, but I got it anyways. And then um, a pink picture frame that's like disco I don't know why I'm explaining it all to you and I'll probably just show you it later but it's like a disco -y pink picture frame oh and then I got another juicy couture candle one that I've never seen before and it smelled really good so I had to get it I'm gonna do Apple Pay Thank you. Thanks, you too. Let's see, the sweet tea isn't good. Well, I'll try to whip it out of here without running over the curb. Mm. The sweet tea is a lot better than last time actually. It's like way sweeter. I drive home and I'll eat and then I'll let you know what I'm gonna do. Probably start working in the room. So shit. <laughs> Probably start a part of my French. Uh, you guys know I cuss, but I try to keep it to a minimum. That's just how I am in my real life. There's really like nothing to it. Well, actually, if you're close to me, like, we get real close, like, we're friends, like, we're just chilling, like, you're gonna see me kind of talk on another level. Okay, I'm getting distracted. I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna eat, and I'm going to, um, I'll, I'll see you when I see ya. Hey, girl, I literally just finished eating. I'm ready to give you a quick haul. Hang on, I'm thirsty. I just started this, I'm like, I'm thirsty. So I'm just gonna do like this. This is just fine, but, um, I went to Walmart first, got needed some paper towels. I just got a two-pack because... I don't know if these are better than the ones I get at Meyer or not, so I didn't want to get like a big, big pack. These are the sprinkles that I got for the cupcakes that I'm gonna make. Aren't these like so cute? There's like pearls in there and little hearts and, ooh, I'm a little bit full from eating, but here's the mix I got. It's like just confetti mix. And then, oh my gosh, here's the Hello Kitty pajama set. This is so cute. I'm probably gonna wear this tonight. This is literally so cute. I hope that the shorts fit me good. That's always like the iffy part with these sets. Some shorts fit me better than like others. Because you know in the summer, well really you don't know because I've only been on YouTube since like the fall. But in the summer I wear a lot of like double layered shorts because it's just like really comfortable. 
you know <laughs> I can further explain that in the summer but I also got some of these like cupcake things which are so cute I also got some AAA batteries because I really need some my nose hair trimmer was like dying on me this morning so I don't think it got all the hairs this is cupcake icing it's pink cupcake icing how freaking cute I'm gonna make like the cutest cupcakes ever is that everything I got for them yeah just this the liners the sprinkles and the icing gonna be so so cute now let me show you what I got at let me show you what I got at TJ Maxx at TJ Maxx I think oh my gosh. Whew, I'm breaking stuff <laughs> that scared me I got this the juicy couture candle fallen for juicy which I've seen on TikTok, but I've never I've never seen this one in person it smells really good it's springy floral-y those are like my favorite scents and so this which i almost just dropped i got this is the mirror i was telling you about how cute is this especially like in my bedroom with the makeover going on i think it's gonna be so cute i'm also thinking to end in this vlog and posting it tonight because um you know i don't want it to go on for too too long we're just taking this decluttering stuff like day by day slowly so don't expect like a whole lot in one vlog we're also just like this is my life you know we're also just living life well, I just noticed this little PJ set comes with an extra pink um, button. The PJ set was $15, which ain't too bad. I got one more thing at TJ Maxx. I got this. This is the little measuring cup I had got. So it says it measures in ounces and milliliters. So not actual cups. So I would have to like convert it or something. But I thought this was just so cute. I don't have any kind of measuring cup at all. I only have the measuring like spoons. So I was really excited for this because it was like, oh, something useful and cute. And I feel like I need to go do some shopping while it's this season right before Valentine's Day because that's when they come out with all the cute pink stuff. Like that's when I got most of what I have like in my kitchen and stuff. I got last Valentine's season. And so I think I might go shopping some more this week before, um, well, before I'm done decluttering just so I can make sure I secure some of those good items for after I'm done decluttering. But next, I'm definitely going to do the kitchen. Well, like the drinks and stuff. I have so many tumblers. I'm getting rid of like all of them. And then right now, like the stuff with the totes, I'm just going to take them to the glam room and the toy room. And then I'll kind of decide what I want to donate out of them. Like what doesn't fit, what I can work with. That's why I also want to like kind of rearrange in there some more. Like get another shelf in that glam room. But with the toy room, I really got to like rearrange and I don't even know where to start, but. Oh my gosh, here's the pajama set. I can't lie, this is really cute. And the shorts are actually, these might be like my favorite fit shorts that I've seen. They're really fitting and I don't know. I really like this set. I feel really cute. It's only four o'clock. It might be a little early for something like this, but I think I'm already chilling it for the rest of the night. It's really soft too. Usually I only like satin, but this has just like a really soft feel to it. So it's nice. Tell me why I'm just noticing too. Hello Kitty has a little boyfriend. Oh my gosh, what the heck? Morning really. So I fell asleep because I was watching the prison confessions of Gizzy, Gypsy Rose, which is really incredible, by the way. I'm literally on the last episode. So since I did it in this vlog and edit and upload it last night, I'll go ahead and vlog today and I'll end it tonight and I'll post it tonight. I slept so comfy in my new PJs, but I just wanted to hop on here real fast before I shower and got cute because I hit 40,000 subscribers on YouTube. Oh my gosh, that's incredible. But it's 100% because of the TikTok I posted yesterday. So I told people on TikTok that I quit my job, but I put in like the caption like, um like explanation on my youtube and so that video has 2 million views right now on tiktok and i hit over 700k on tiktok so i'm at 705k on tiktok which is crazy so that was like two goals in one night and then on youtube let's go to it 43 subscribers which is insane it all happened so quick and that video where i had quit has 108,000 views. That's my most views for a YouTube video. So that's just literally insane. And I'm almost halfway there to getting the silver plaque. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna cry. I cannot wait to get that silver plaque. Like, I just know I'm gonna be getting it here soon. Like, I can feel it in my bones. What's up, girlie? I just got out of the shower. It's a bit stormy right now. Um, I'll try to show you out my little side door, but... I kind of just was real lazy this morning. I like played Minecraft for a little bit with my online friend, which there's nothing wrong with that, having like a little bit of a lazy day, especially whenever I do work like every single day, most of the day. 
but the rain, the rain and the wind is starting to come down hard. But look, so I used that brown mascara today. Can you tell it's brown? I had to use like a lot of coats because it doesn't go on as thick as like the black mascara. That's my only um, complaint about it. But look, I got a package from YSL and I had opened it while I was on Discord and on Minecraft with my friends. This is just like the proof that I had gotten the package from YSL. But they sent me like a men's cologne, which I was thinking like, ugh, I only really wear perfume. But it smells really good. I'm really grateful anyways. But um, yeah, I wish they would have sent me a perfume, not a cologne. Because it smells so, so good. But like, I'll be saving this for my next man. I have like another one, this nautical one. I'm saving that for my next man, saving this for my next man. So like I got gifts for a man that's not even in my life yet. But you can hear like, well that's an airplane. But you can hear like the rain starting to come in. Let me show you through my side door. It said it was about to start picking up here real soon. My trash can had blown over so I just went and picked it up. Yeah, you can't see much and I'm not trying to show you like all the trailers around me just for my privacy. I just got an Instacart order, so a little grocery haul. I've also decided it's kind of a lazy day if you haven't already caught that dress. So I'm wearing my um, almost day we wear pink shirt. It's like a mean girl shirt. I accidentally got like some stains on it. I was like pinching my fingers on it. I was like, why'd I do that? But um, I got this fettuccine broccoli alfredo. This is a big one. This is different than the one I usually get. They were probably just out of the one I usually get. This is the main thing I was craving, some more of these chicken rings. I needed some of these. And then this isn't what I ordered. I had found some bacon. It was like a buffalo chicken bacon something and that sounded so good, but they apparently didn't have it. So this was the sub and this sounds pretty good too. White cheddar mac and cheese with bacon. It's like the twisty mac and cheese, so box a little damaged but this looks good i got some of these plates because the plastic ones are cute but like they're really kind of expensive there's really not much of a difference that's just kind of like for the aesthetic um i got some of these booty wipes okay so i had added this while he was at the store a sewing kit and i don't think there's even a pink in here but my pink blanket that um it's okay i can just use like a I don't know. I want it pink. Why didn't I look at the colors? Is that pink or is that red? My blanket. Oh yeah, there's a pink in there. Okay, so I can use that little pink. My blanket last night. I tried to cut off the tag and I was doing it so carefully so it wouldn't get a hole in it. And it got a hole in it. And it's like a really comfy king size juicy couture blanket. So of course I want that. And I thought he didn't find this. It's dented, but hang on. It said on the app that he couldn't find my hairspray, right? I thought it said he couldn't find it, unless I'm just mistaken. Let me see. Oh, it does say found. I could have swore, like, it had popped up saying not found. So maybe he found it at the very end or someone or, like, the person he was with. Ew. Yeah, they found a gross looking one. What the freak is that? So, I don't know really how to sew. I kind of get the basis. Like, whenever I was younger, I would sew toilet paper back together. So we'll try that tonight, but I'm just going to make some food real quick and I'm not sure what I'm gonna make yet. Yeah, I haven't decided if I'll just make this or if I want the chicken rings. I kinda want the chicken rings. I don't think I want this right now, the mac and cheese thing. Ooh, this could be good with the chicken rings. You know what, maybe, maybe. I also wanted to tell you, I was just on, just looking on Prime because I just finished the prison confessions of Gypsy Rose and it was really good. I don't know why I feel so close to her. I'm like, I hope we cross paths one day. Like, I really hope we do. I just heard that. I know I should have freaking ordered a battery alarm when I just did that Instacart order. But, um, for the smoke alarm. But I really hope I cross paths with her one day. Like, I just want to, you know, kind of be her friend. I feel like she really had a lot happen in her life. Like, something that me and you really can't even, like, began to imagine even though we've heard all the details but she came out of it really strong that's like the most impressive thing but anyways I was just about to say that I want to watch the new Hunger Games I saw that the new Hunger Games was on there it's like $20 to rent it and like $25 just to buy it but I'll probably just rent it because I probably don't need to buy it I feel like that's going to be one of those movies that in a year or so like you're going to see in the thrift stores like how you see the Hunger, Hunger Games like all the time in thrift stores like I thrifted all my Hunger Games movies but um, it's the prequel, so that sounds pretty good. I might watch that. And my favorite Hunger Game movies are definitely the first two. I really like the second one because I feel like it's almost like 
more dramatic but I really just like when they're in the arena like this is my favorite part of the movies not to sound basic I used to play Minecraft Hunger Games so like if you used to play Minecraft like MCSG like just let me know if you know because I used to be on that but just when they're in the arena is like all the coolest parts to me I decided on the mac and cheese for right now because I really don't feel like waiting for the chicken ring so I'll just make those later if I really want to I don't know if y'all have ever peeped this in my TikToks it's just like a splatter bowl so that you're like sauces sauces and stuff don't splatter so bad but this looks really good I'll show you in a second but it actually looks really fancy so first you gotta stir it it said do like this and then stir it real good and then cover it up and put it back in for another two minutes but look these are like actually good looking noodles and like the white cheddar cheese smells good and the bacon smells good. This all smells so good. I'm sure it would have been good with the chicken rings. I just I literally don't feel like waiting for them to make because it's going to take like 20 minutes. So give this a nice stir. Whereas this only takes like less than 10. And I'm sure it will fill me up. Okay. Go ahead and put it back on the most we can. And then back in for two more minutes I think it said I'm gonna do like 215 two minutes 15 seconds just to be safe all right here we go it looks freaking delish it like got a little bit thicker too Ooh, don't make don't let it slide out I can see the little bacon bits in it but we're gonna get a bite on a fork with a little bit of bacon bits mac and cheese come on where's the bacon bits a little bit sparse with the bacon bits y'all Okay. I feel like a bite's about to fall. I don't want to burn the roof of my mouth. Let it cool down. It's like that TikTok audio. <laughs> Cack it down. Stop. Mmm. Mm, still hot but that cheese is good noodles are a little soft but that's okay and I mean I could taste the bacon bacon flavor is pretty good yeah Gordon and Ramsay be like noodles are soggy <laughs> but I'm not that picky and I think this thing was like how much was it let's go let's check the facts this stuff was $3.99. So $4, it's not bad. It's honestly meant to be like a side. But um, it's my main course right now. What's up, girly? I just finished the movie. It was so good, but it was way longer than I thought. It was like over two hours. It was really, really good. But like, I honestly don't understand why. And this name's hard for me to say, but like, I don't understand why Snow and Lucy Gray couldn't just stay in love and run away together <laughs> like I wish it just would end it like that but then there wouldn't have been like the whole hunger against the Katniss and stuff but I have like no energy to end this vlog right now so I'm not going to I'm going to end it in the morning and then I'll probably edit and post it in the morning because I just don't have the energy my head kind of hurts I kind of have a headache and it's just so annoying I feel like I've been so sluggish the past like day or so and I don't know what it is but I hope I just like ugh, come out of it tomorrow's my last free day I mean not my last free day but then you know I got um a dentist appointment day after tomorrow and then hair or no nail appointment day after that and then the photo shoot so I'm really excited slash nervous and I need to get rid of these headaches and gain the motivation so I really like the movie and if you haven't seen it you should see it especially if you like Hunger Games but now I want to watch it now that I can watch it and like the point of view knowing a little bit about the past what's up girly it's the next day so I'm gonna end the vlog here in just a second I started to get my motivation back I woke up I cleaned my whole house and then I showered I might make some cupcakes tonight just kind of keep it easy I also have a dentist appointment tomorrow so Maybe cupcakes the night before cleaning isn't a smart idea, but I'm still going to do it. I feel good about my makeup today. Like, my lashes are, like, they were a struggle at first, but then I was like, wow, they're really lashing. <laughs> but my shirt, this is just, like, kind of one of my get-ready shirts. I have, like, wiped makeup all over it. This is just, I have a few shirts like this. They're, like, a handful of shirts I just use to get ready with. But I believe that this is my camera. 
So I had gotten a just more, what are you doing, cat? Just like a pocket camera. I had gotten like a pocket camera just for vlogging, like a more discreet camera, that's what I was trying to say. For vlogging in public. And let's see. This is supposed to be pretty nice, so look at it. It's called the Osmo Pocket 3, DGI Osmo Pocket 3. I saw this on TikTok. I actually saw the two on TikTok, and the two had like a smaller screen, but I was like, ooh, I should get the three. Now, remember my Splenda Daddy, that's what someone called them, and I really like that. My Splenda Daddy ordered me this, so this was like 500 something. I will add it to my Amazon storefront just under, what is that little tag called? I think I have something called like content creating, just like stuff that helps me with that. And so I'll put this with that. Like I think the vlogging camera I'm using right now, the same exact one I bought is on there. I actually got it refurbished, but it was like brand new. Like it literally came like brand new. Like I, you couldn't even tell it was refurbished. I'm trying to get this little plastic off, but I'm really excited for this. See if the camera quality is nice, the audio is nice. I literally had a dream last night that I was like testing it for the first time ever, like going into a store with it. I just like it because it's a bit smaller than the camera that we're recording on right now. Part of my nails. My nail appointment's in two days, the day after tomorrow, after my dentist appointment. And I think I'm just gonna do classic French tip since I'm doing that little photo shoot thing. I just want like a classic French tip. So this is it. What is this, like a case? Yeah, that's like a case. So this is the actual camera. This is really small. But that's what I wanted, right? Hold up, what is this? Oh, that's the camera. This little rolly thing, that's the camera. So now, so you do it like this. And then, ooh, I just took the little sticker off the screen. I'm gonna have to watch a video on how to use this. It took me a second to learn how to use the camera we're vlogging on right now. Oh, it goes sideways. I was trying to like pull it out. Okay, so you can turn it any which way. But it doesn't feel like it's locking. It seems like it wants to stay stuck on that way. Okay, English. Okay, so you have to download the app and you gotta get it going. That's what it's telling me to do. But look at how just cute this thing is. Hang on, let it focus. Why is it not focused on this? It's like not focusing, but it's really cute. Like it's not focusing on the screen. It looks really nice. Oh, so this turns it off whenever you do it like that way. That was cute how it just turned off. So I'll learn how to use this and I'll let you guys know. Let's see, I don't even see, like where does the memory card go into? Is that it? That's like a tiny memory card slot. Completely different than my other camera. I thought it would be like, I don't know. I just want this as like a little extension for my content creating on YouTube. <laughs> it's so cute. So look, when you shut it off, well now it's back with a shut off, but when you opened it, it like moved. Okay, it's about to turn off. See how it turned? <laughs> so now whenever I turn this little screen, it like turned, you see that? And it's asking me my language again. Oh my gosh, it's turning. This thing's weird, so I gotta, I gotta learn how to use it, but for $500, like hopefully the quality is good and I can actually use this for going in stores, because this is really nice. It's like smaller than my phone. Where's my phone at? So we can compare it. This is my iPhone and, and this is the camera. It's a literally smaller than it. So this is like perfect for going in public and not being so shy. So I'm really excited to give this a go. And maybe you'll see me using it in the next vlog if I can figure out how to use it quick enough. But also in the next vlog, we will be doing dentist appointment, nail appointment, photo shoot. So fun, so excited for all those. But I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here now so I can go ahead and post it and edit it this morning. I've been in kind of in a rut lately, like motivation low, but I woke up and it's starting to feel high again. I think it's just like beginning of the year, slow dome. I don't know what you would call it, but it's really weird. Um, anyways, I hope that you like, comment, subscribe, ring the notification bell, all the good goods, and I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye, girly.